Next generation wireless, especially the sixth generation, is uh, moving to higher frequencies up above 100 gigahertz. And one of the keys is the energy will be narrowly focused between the transmitter and receiver. And it's believed that because of that focus energy that it will be very difficult for an eavesdropper to intercept the signal and overhear it. And so the focus of this work was to uh, show that a strong adversary can use a what we call a meta surface in the middle uh, in order to intercept the signal, even if it's highly directive. I will demonstrate the principles of the attack and the small scale. Here in this case, you can see the transmitter and the receiver, legitimate transmitter receiver that are separated one meter apart in this case. If you consider an eavesdropper who is angularly separated from the legitimate receiver, you can see in the screen that uh, eavesdropper is not receiving any data. She's essentially absorbing the noise. However, with the meta surface in the middle attack, what you can observe is that eavesdropper can intelligently manipulate the impinging wave and diffract a portion of the signal towards herself, thereby successfully eavesdropping on the communication. This is very serious threat because now if you go back to the legitimate receiver, a receiver will have a very, very hard time recognizing whether the attack occurred in the first place because the power drop that she observes is very, very minimal. And those power drop are usually characteristic of the uh, ordinary wireless communications. So therefore, transmitter and receiver exposed to this dangerous threat. We're very concerned about the security of long distance wireless links. Sometimes they're between rooftops and they're called backhaul links. And they're very highly directional. And it's thought that, that an adversary can't possibly uh, intercept them because the, the signal is only going between those two rooftops. So the concern is that an adversary with uh, a drone can take a meta service in the middle, attach it to the drone, and then diffract the signal off to the location of the adversary to eavesdrop. The key first step to counteract it is to be aware of the threats. That if there's an unknown threat, then that's when you're most vulnerable. So knowing about this as a possible threat can help designers to secure their network against this threat. There are multiple things that they could do, including uh, ensuring that the link is, is uh, in, encrypted and just expect it to be uh, intercepted by an adversary. Um, and it can also be to try to detect the adversary. And so there are ways that we could use um, advanced sensing in order to detect whether the adversary is uh, between the sender and receiver.